Hey guys, today I'm gonna to show you how to see the hidden files within your Finder. And so if you open your Finder, and say you go to applications here, you have all your files here, you have all your applications, you have all of your programs. Well, there are actually some things that are hidden in here that you don't see. Do you want to see them? Well, we're gonna do a terminal command to actually show you these hidden files that you don't know exist here. So if we open our nifty terminal here, hit enter, set it all up, we are going to need two commands. The first command is going to actually do the change within the system, and then the second command is going to reboot our finder so that the change, that the hidden files actually show up and the change takes place. So we are going to write defaults, which is going to access our defaults, and then we're going to write, because we're writing something new, and changing the system, and then we're going to write com.apple.finder to access our finder, and then we're going to write apple show all files, and this is like a property, this is gonna be, are we showing all the files, yes or no? And we are gonna say yes, because we wanna see all of our files, including the hidden ones. We'll hit enter. Are we done yet? No, we still have to reboot our Finder and make sure the change is updated and it's in our current Finder window when we open a new one. And so we can log out and then log back in to do this, but that takes time and is annoying, so we do a simple command and we write kill all Finder, hit enter, It'll bring us back here. And if we go to our Finder now and go to our applications, we have two hidden files here. We got this .ds store and we got this .localized. The .ds store is basically like, okay, how are my files formatted here inside of my applications window? Like they're in alphabetical order right now. I can go click all of them and then go to like view and then arrange by and then change that here, that change the idea of what it looks like here in the finder that would be saved in the DS store. So now you know they're here. How do I make them go away? Because they're annoying. Well, you can open your terminal again and you can write defaults, write com.apple.finder, apple show all files, space and then say no. We do not want to see all the files. We only want to see the ones that are not hidden. Hit enter and then we will kill all finder. Again, updating it. Here we open our finder again and look, they are gone. And as I've mentioned before, you can do ls to see what's inside of your directory if you don't want to open the finder and stuff and then you can do ls-a to see the hidden files within your directory. Again, there's a .ds store down here per usual. So I hoped you learned something in this video. We basically used a simple command to show the hidden files within our finder so that we could see them, you know, know they're there, and then we re-hid all of our hidden files by doing the same command but saying no, and then remembering to reboot the finder so that the changes are in sync, they're updated, our finder is doing what we told it to do via terminal. Again, I hoped you learned something and I'll see you next week.